Hi to Chaco. Of happy versus chic. We of course are excited to watch this finals. This super finals. It is on that mirror finals. Happy at the top. He is go he's in the red of course. He has an altar. He has a necropolis. He has a crypt. He has a ziggurat. At the bottom, in the pink, we have Sheik. He has a necropolis, he has a crypt, he has an altar, he has a graveyard. What an early game, what a nice early game here for this match. Happy wins 3 0. We'll see, we'll see. Maybe she can do some amazingness and win this game or win all games. Maybe uh, Sheik will win 3 0. Yeah, well then. Look at this ghoul, he's chopping the tree, the ziggurat is up. Death Knight is being summoned, of course. He will be here soonish. Tomb of Relics is going up. And this Tomb of Relics is going up a bit earlier. So they're doing a different build, that's for sure. Look at this early death knight with the ghouls. Wait. Happy, you know, maybe I should have talked about this. Happy doesn't have a graveyard. <laughs> and Sheik is just doing the death knight fiend build. Death knight ghouls. Death knight ghouls. I've never seen Happy do this before in my life. But. But what? But, um. This map is special. It's a ma special map. So maybe that's why he does this build. Because there's no way to get to your opponent's base until it's dark. So uh, look at this Death Knight. <laughs> Killing this null. He kills the null. Picks up a Tome of Agility. Nice job here by the Death Knight. He's getting more ghouls. Ghouls are so nice here. So nice. And he's killing all these little nulls. Over, over here, meanwhile, we have a fiend. Not sure what the fiend is up to. He's standing in the water. There's so many places to stand, but he's just standing and resting in the water. Maybe it's hot and the water cools him down. Uh, Death Knight go for the uh, kills the piggy. He's going for the expansion. Early expansion play here by Happy. Never seen this before. This is the super happy strategy. And he's going for the expansion. There it is. Nice timing on that expansion. The Acolyte just summoning that expansion. The Death Knight level 2. Uh, that is beautiful. We see another Acolyte being built here for uh, Happy. Another one. Sheik is just creeping here with Fiends. Killing this uh, Nightcrawler now. And all these, these Murlocs, they are so doomed. You know, over here we see Happy creeping also Murlocs. These Murlocs, they're just dying. We have a nice uh, replenishment potion and a berry up here on Happy Staff Knight. Well, Sheik, he has also a replenishment potion, but he has a mantle of IQ. So he's very smart. 20 IQ. Look at all these acolytes. Sheik is stacking and building more fiends. These skeletons sent across the map. And uh, Happy kills all these murlocs. And he also has a mantle of intelligence now. He's pretty smart as well. <coughs> as well. So they have similar items, only there's a parry up on this death knight. He used a replenishment item or uh, potion already. The schools here scouting, they see the fiends, they see the death knight. Death knight, does he get a parry up? If he gets a parry up, he does! This this is such a balanced matchup, such a balanced map. They get exactly the same items so far. This death knight, what's he uh, up to over here? Buying more skeletons maybe? Yeah. Buy some more skeletons. These two skeletons going to the main base here. Off Sheik. A player's forces are under attack. The Death Knight some some skeletons from over here. The There's still one creep camp over here. On his side of the map. A piggy over there, by the way. Look at the Acolytes working on that gold. And Happy is stacking to tier 2. Is he getting more ghouls? Don't think he's going to switch to fiends anytime soon. He's getting this ogre now. And uh, the same here for Sheik. He's creeping the same creep camp. Oh, the Death Knight now. The Wand of Lightning Shield. Let's see if Sheik gets the same one. It would be a much better item for Sheik though. 
He also has a level 3 Death Knight. Gets a second Mantle of Intelligence. Here we get a Cloak of Shadows for Happy, but he doesn't even pick it up. He does buy the Shredder, by the way. Here we have the um, Replenishment Potion. Oh, what's happening here? Wakes up the middle, the creeps in the middle. Does he want the Ogre Lord? Happy sends over a skeleton. The ghouls, I mean, you know, the ghouls aren't that great against these ogres. That's the weakness of the ghouls. Happy just wants the level 7 ogre lord. There goes one ogre. Rah, rah, rah. Happy's death knight snuck through. And his ghouls now as well. What are the ghouls going for? This ghoul is super low, takes a coil. Surrounds a fiend. Oh my god, the first fiend already dead. Even with the coil, he's still going to die. There's no burrow or anything. He kills a ghoul though for uh, in return. There was another ghoul over here with lightning shield. It takes a coil as well. He's doing a little bit of damage here against his fiends. He does go down eventually. The death knight sends two ghouls to the uh, acolytes. Saves another ghoul there. This fiend oh, almost died. Nice uh, coil there with Sheik. Sheik uh, needs to save his acolytes because, you know, you know, they're being targeted. Nice coil there on the fiend. And Happy loses so many ghouls. And uh, oh, co come on, Happy. One skeleton, one right click, and this acolyte is dead. Wow. Even Happy making a mistake sometimes is uh, so surprising to see. Oh, does he see the acolyte now? He sees it. Does he see it? No, he doesn't. The ghoul here that's dead is going for an acolyte. But uh, this acolyte should have died a long time ago. The Death Knight now has to TP out. Does that mean she can uh, creep the center? Of course, Happy has the uh, expansion, so losing ghouls in return for uh, units is usually pretty good. But uh, he only got the one fiend. I'm not sure how many acolytes he got, like one or maybe two, but not that many. She has six acolytes now. The, sh uh, the lich and the fiend creeping. Here comes Happy again with one fiend. Some more fiends. He has double crit, by the way. There's a lich. <laughs> Slaughterhouse going up. These units are dying. Is this uh this level seven overlord? Wait, did he kill it? Did he kill it? Oh, he got it. She got the level seven overlord. Class of attack plus fifteen. So this lich now does plus twenty one damage. That's uh decent. This ogre, ogre Mauler takes a bit of damage as well. Happy picks up another tome. What? Where is he going? Is he trying to kill the skeleton? <laughs> Happy kills his Ogre Mauler now. He still doesn't have the orb. Coil Nova is it. Here is the drop though for Sheik. A Zeppelin drop on Happy's expansion. And the Ekla is running. Running for their life. Is Happy going to defend? He's going to defend. He's not going for a base race. Would have been an easy cancel on the Slaughterhouse. And then maybe uh, kill some more units. But he's going for the defend. I think she can hold. I mean, Sheik doesn't have the orb yet either, but he does have plus 21 damage here on that uh, Lich. Black Citadel is going up, and look at this. Evacuation. Sheik is expanding here, but the Skeleton does scout it. And this Acolyte doesn't care about the Skeleton, but the Skeleton expires just before the Acolyte dies. Three hit points. Of course, Sheik knew this. Sheik, you know, he's a smart player. He knows exactly when the skeleton was going to expire. This was all calculated, of course. A fiend here in the back. I assume he has web. He was planning to web that uh, zeppelin. But she came from an unexpected uh, angle. These acolytes are dying. The fiend will survive, but there's a TP out here by Sheik. The fiend, fiend is still fine. Sheik has 1-0 upgrades on his fiends. Happy has 1-1 one, one upgrades already. He's getting more acolytes. And... Uh, beautiful. Do, do, do. He's not getting more upgrades, he's getting more acolytes. So the game is this kind of equal, right? Because, you know, their expansion is kind of equal at this point. Oh, but we have a fight. Happy is up 3 supply. But Sheik has more gold. This acolyte is dead. These fiends, you know, they're stuck here. Oh, what can Happy kill here? Easy cancel the cigarette and this acolyte as well. Is going down. One acolyte is dead. The second acolyte here. 
also that the ziggurat is down the lich here with the fiends defending against the skeletons the fiend michael of course happy has beautiful michael nice nova there on the skeletons the skeletons all dying uh and you know there's two skeletons left for happy there's an acolyte uh, walking past and look at the lightning shield here oh, and she splits his fiends he only has four fiends against six fiends this is a two fiend advantage and the lich here dies the coil, he wanted the coil, but the coil was way too late. The Lich uh, for Happy had the orb, by the way. So even though Sheik had plus 21 damage, the orb is just too powerful. GG. Sheik here in the top left in the purple. Building a crypt and altar. Happy building a graveyard this game. This game is going for early fiends. And of course, he's going for a late death knight. Well, Sheik is going for an early death knight. And late fiends, I assume he's going fiends, that is. And I assume he's going for Death Knight of this, and not a Lich. But we'll see. You never know with Sheik. You never know. There's an Acolyte. This Acolyte builds a Tomb of Relics. Oh, what does it mean? Does it mean there's no graveyard? Does it mean he's going ghouls? It means he's going ghouls, right? Doesn't mean he's going Lich. Do we see a Lich? I wonder if we're gonna see a Lich. Is this a Lich? No, that's a Death Knight. Sheik with the Death Knight. Happy. Is he going Lich? Is he going Lich with Fiends? I doubt it, but you know. I'm just saying it might be an option. Maybe it is a Crypt Lord. Crypt Lord and Fiends. That would be so exciting. So exciting to see Crypt Lord with Fiends. That's what I want to see. Can we see, please see the Crypt Lord and the Fiends or Dreadlord Fiends? Even better. Dreadlord and Fiends. Imagine if Happy is playing that for the first time in his life. Now it's a Death Knight and Fiends. Okay. Here we have a Death Knight and Ghouls. Death Knight and Ghouls. And Death Knight and Ghouls. Okay, so Death Knight against Death Knight. You know, one Death Knight has uh, fiends as allies, the other Death Knight has ghouls as his allies. This Tomb of Relics is up, is going up, it's almost up. It's so close to being up. It is... Is up too early? It is up, but the Death Knight isn't even out yet. It's up, up pretty early. Here we have a Death Knight, does he have a backpack? Oh no, he already bought items. He saw this TP and bought skeletons. And he kills a little uh, uh, crap thing. He's going for the ghouls. I can sense it. Happy, of course, he doesn't sell his TP. Keeps his TP, some skeletons, and leaves his base. But here comes Sheik. Maybe if Sheik was just a split second later, Happy was further away from... No, he was going to creep the green camp, creep camp anyway. Uh, beautiful block here by Happy. Only two uh, articles. Uh, they, they had to walk around the shop. This fiend takes a coil. Two fiends here to defend against this super ghoul attack. Like I see like six ghouls or so. Two and some skeletons. This fiend. He has more coils of course to save the fiend. At least one more coil. This uh, aura here for Sheik does have the aura first. Unholy aura. No, no coil. We have a spirit tower going up here for Happy. One acolyte did go down but he can remake the acolyte. This acolyte is also dead. Two dead acolytes. Our spirit tower is up. It's killing ghouls and stuff. These uh, ghouls, they they, uh, they didn't want to die, but you know they signed up for this hit squad voluntarily. So uh, you know it's their own their own choice. They're all dying. There goes another acolyte. The third acolyte dead. But so many ghouls are dead now. He's uh, running in with two more ghouls. Going for the fiend. Can he get a fiend? He's trying to get his fiend. He gets his fiend surrounded. Happy has one more coil. Does he use it on the fiend? He uses it on the fiend. This uh, ghoul is dead. Can he, the fiend survive? The fiend... He does survive. And the ghoul doesn't even try to finish it off. And this looks like an easy defense here for Happy. Five acolytes. He has a tower. He didn't lose a fiend. Happy is up by two supply now. A player's forces are under attack. Let's see. Sheik Dax... Build a graveyard. More ghouls. One, two, three, four. I see five ghoul bodies. But that's uh 
I'm not sure if more ghouls died because if a ghoul dies and you summon a skeleton from his body, you don't see his body anymore, right? So I see some dead acolytes here as well. The one over there, there's one over there. So beautiful. Happy going for some more murlocs. These murlocs are taking so much damage. Nice coil here on the fiend. You all chic. Here at the other side of the map. This ghoul, I mean, he doesn't want to die. This ghoul takes a bit of damage. This, uh, okay, he kills a little, little turtle. Now he's going for this crab. Spider crab. It sounds, sounds disgusting, but it's actually just crab. It's, uh, pretty tasty. She tried once. Uh, this crab, you know, he got one. Unfortunately, he didn't upgrade cannibalism, so he cannot eat the crabs. Not with the ghouls, at least. He sends these ghouls home. The Death Knight finishes off this guy. And uh, there it is, Ring of Protection plus two. Mew over here, happy. Oh, look at these items. So great for the list in a moment. Claws of Attack, Mantle of Intelligence. And now he gets a silly ring. That's not what he wanted. But uh, that's what he deserves. Here comes the Death Knight. For Sheik, is he going for these uh, Dark Tools? He's going for the Dark Tools, but he's sleeping. The Death Knight is sleeping. And he's awake again. But here comes Happy. What can Happy do? Happy is uh, equal in supply. He's going for a ghoul. There's so many ghouls here and there's a ghouls here. I'm not sure if it's good for Happy. Like, I mean, if you can get a ghoul, that's nice. Coils the skeletons. Kills a ghoul. But here comes a flank attack. And there's two cold towers up now because the House of the Dead is done upgrading. So the ghouls, uh, they have easy surface area over the, the fiends. You know, and they kill them so easily and so nicely. There goes one fiend. And Happy will have to TP as well, so... He he lost the Fiend, he killed like an uh, Acolyte and maybe a Ghoul. Yeah, a Ghoul and an Acolyte. But for a TP and a Fiend, I don't think that's worth it. Not sure what that is. A player's forces are okay, this is also an Acolyte, I guess. So Happy already creeping over here after TPing out. Does he get a Lich? There's a Lich. It's the House of the Dead. Giving these items to the Lich. The Lich is gonna do plus 15 damage. That's without the orb. After the, he gets the orb, it's plus 20 damage. Death Knight level 3.6 or so. Here for Sheik, the Death Knight is level 3. Point something. Okay, there's a Lich. There's a Lich for Sheik. So Sheik's Lich, was he first? Yeah. Sheik is on the right side. Attack. Well, we have this beautiful uh, fight here in the middle. Happy. With fiends. Killing. So, uh, kills a ghoul. Nice ghoul. I, d I don't know why the ghoul was over there, by the way. But uh, the Death Knight is going for this little... What is it? The, the Macriel? Macriel-ra? So tasty. Look at this ghoul flank attack, though. While I was looking at the macro rust. Beautiful flank attack here by uh, Sheik. He has a fiend surrounded. But here comes the Lich of Happy from the high ground. This fiend is dead. There's a Nova on the Death Knight of Sheik. He doesn't have anything to save his Death Knight besides his pure movement speed. But he, uh, he's being blocked by the fiend. He does get away. There's no... The Nova is... Uh, oh, wait. Why are you coming back? Uh, he was so... Oh, he used his second Nova already. I didn't realize... I didn't realize Happy used his second Nova already, so the Death Knight was safe. Or maybe that's what he just used. He used a Nova on the Lich. This fiend is Michael Durant. This is a mana fountain, by the way. This is a random fountain. Could be either a mana fountain or a healing fountain, just like a Norwood. This guy, d does someone kill this guy? Yeah, he dies. Lich is level 1, Death Knight level 4. We have Lord Malthazar. And of course, Ordin Fosbane. Here we have uh, Rage Winterchill and Lord Solrender. He picks up a Tome of Agility. There goes another uh, another little animal guy. And Happy going for this Murloc. This level 7 Murloc, the Shadowcaster. And he's dead. He picks up the boots of Qua... No, Robot Magi. 
Pretty good one. This Lich now doing plus 21 damage. After he gets the orb, it's gonna be plus 26. Six. He doesn't have the backpack though, so... And he is a black citadel. How is he gonna get that orb? Oh, definitely took a lot of damage here from this creep. This guy does a decent damage. Warsong battle drums for even more damage here. This Lich already does plus 25. With the orb, it will be plus 30. This is gonna be such a powerful Lich. Look at Sheik's Lich. Ha! <laughs> plus 11. <laughs> That's already with the orb as well. Okay. Yeah, good luck. Good luck, Sheik. And a Dark Ranger. Is that indeed Sheik's Dark Ranger or is that Happy's? No, that's Happy's Dark Ranger. And Happy is on the left. Oh, no, never mind. That's correct. That's a Dark Ranger for Happy. Here she is. Whoa! This Lich is only level 2, but that's good enough. Here comes the orb. He's gonna give this orb to this uh, Lich. Plus 30 damage. Oh, nice book. But Sheik doesn't like to read. Doesn't like to read a uh, bi biography of Arthas. Okay, look at the Death Knight here creeping. The crabs, the crabs are taking a bit of damage. You have sea turtles as well. Attacking uh, skeletons. One skeleton does go down. There goes a turtle. Death Knight now level 4. The ghouls just attack whatever. There's a wand of illusion here for Sheik. Ring of protection plus 2. He picks it up. He has a destroyer. Is he going for the main base? There is the spirit tower up still. Temple of the Damned is going up. Uh, this one is going up. Web is going up. These ghouls are fake. Don't be fooled by the fake ghouls. Does Happy have a DP? He has a TP and two Warsong Battle Drums. Unfortunately, they don't stack for him. TP's in. 34 damage on the Lich. He has two Rope of the Magus. Are you kidding me? 615 mana. This Lich, as long as Happy doesn't lose his Lich, he's gonna win this game easy peasy. And uh, the Lich, you know, every time he attacks, someone dies. This Death Knight almost dies. These Destroyers are going down pretty fast. We have Ghouls here, but they, they get Nova because we have unlimited Novas. Almost, actually. Actually, he only has one more Nova. And GG there by uh, Sheik. I guess he saw the Lich and he's like, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no. <laughs> no. Graveyard Crypt can still be a fast expo build, Chaco. With a Dreadlord. Or with uh, a Death Knight. We have a Death Knight of Fiends here for Happy. We have a Death Knight of Fiend here for Sheik. Do, 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 do. Tal said is Lord, uh, Lord Daron Autumn, maybe. It is uh, Autumn, which is, you know, nice. Uh, uh, anything other than winter is nice. I mean, winter is just so cold. Autumn is kind of cold, but not super cold. We have uh, a Death Knight there. We have a Fiend. He's building a second Fiend. Happy's building the Ziggurat. Is this the same build order? It looks like exactly the same build order, right? Happy's uh, shop is a bit up a bit earlier. These fiends are just scouting the map. Look at these banners. Prime League. Is that, is that where this map comes from? The Prime League. Sheik. Is he going for this? Uh, he's going to creep his expansion, guys. Do we see the fast expansion? Happy is, is creeping the same expansion. I don't see more acolytes, though. Happy going for the Forest of Shadow Priest. He is dead. The Forest of Shadow Priest is dead. Do we see the same here? Sheik kills the Forest of Shadow Priest. Nice. Happy then going for the Ogre Warrior. Is Sheik going for the same one? Sheik is... No, Sheik is going for the Forest of Berserker. He kills the Forest of Berserker. And he gets what item did he get? A Claws of Attack. Now Happy is going for the Forest of Berserker. By the way, one of the Death Knights is disappeared from my overlay, which is beautiful. Which is... Uh, which is, you know, I'm pretty sure that's not my fault. Death Knight that we do have is, I believe, Sheik's Death Knight. So let me move it to the right. And uh, Happy is level 2 on his Death Knight. Sheik as well on his Death Knight. And the Death Knight, what is he going to do here? Walks past the Nulls. 
onto the temple. He's in the temple now. There's a little sofa in the temple. Over here, the death knight killing some gnolls. So nice. He kills all these gnolls. Just skeleton scouting the map. Skeleton here as well, here for Sheik. Both players. Oh, Sheik. Uh, happy. I mean, he's going for the straight for the center. Killing these gnolls here. He's going for the gnoll assassin. Sheik is close by. Sheik. Oh, Sheik doesn't realize the skeleton scouts over there. Sheik is creeping over here. And Happy is just creeping the center. Let's see. Well, Sheik he got a nice gloves of haste. But uh, the center item, of course, super strong. Sheik he gets a circlet. He's still gonna finish off this creep camp. He still doesn't know. Happy is just killing these null overseers. Happy gets an Ankh. And what is he gonna get from the other one? Let's see if she can be in time to get the. Uh, to deny this other null overseer. She gets a bit ahead in XP. These null overseers, they take so long to kill with this healing fountain here. And Happy kills another null. Four fiends here for Happy, four fiends here for Sheik. Death Knight for both of them. The Death Knight is now level 3 here for uh, Sheik, which is pretty good. That means his coils are so much more. There he coils the null because his coils are level 2. He can snipe units so much easier. He's also killing this null, this null poacher. And his Death Knight also does so much damage with these super items. Well, over here, this Death Knight. What can he do? What can Happy do here? Even Happy with this super micro. Tried to snipe it, but he couldn't. Nice potion of info here for this death knight. Hi, chat. Uh, hello, bad fans. 16. Death knight. He finds. He finds Sheik. Good. Happy death knight takes a bit of damage. He's just. Right clicking the ogre. Oh, the coil was too late. And again, she gets XP. He just wants to get a few more XP points to get a level 3. Happy ones. That, but uh, Sheik's definitely already level 3 and half. So nice here by Sheik. Happy's definitely still level 2. This fiend, this fiend is uh, taking a bit of damage, but he's still fine. Death Knight is beautiful. Look at these items. Close of attack, close of attack, close of haste, circlet. This Lich is going to be so happy. Happy is uh, Death Knight is finally level 3. He also gets a ring of protection there. And uh, this fiend, he was in snare for a little bit, but no longer. So Happy does have a Lich. And so does Sheik. They both have a Lich. Whoa, whoa. Beautiful play here by both pairs. And they're going to Black Citadel. They pretty much do exactly the same build here. Fiends here for Happy. Happy creeping over here. Stormbolt right in the face of the Lich. Lich, you know, he's killing rock golems. There's a nice coil here on the Lich. What item did he pick up? Did he sell it already? <laughs> Some sell an Ankh. Did he get an Ankh here and sold it? Did he get an Ankh? Can he get an Ankh here? Maybe he already sold the other Ankh he got from the center. He got an Ankh again and he sold it again. That's probably what happened. The Lich here is almost level 2. The Death Knight. He has a Hood of Cunning here. And Happy now going for the Corner Creep. Yeah, twice Ankh. Happy gets really lucky with these angs. Kappa. Angs aren't that great. Okay, what did he get over here? Happy, he got a ring of regeneration. Is he gonna sell that as well? Meanwhile, over here, Sobi Mask. Much better items here for Sheik. Keeps the ring of regeneration for now. Lich, he's, uh, he's beautiful. 
this lich level three lich now for chic happy still only has a level two lich level two and a half Angst have cooldown. I don't even know. <laughs> we have uh, a Death Knight who is almost level 4. And that's so beautiful. Here's Sheik. And we have a Crypt Lord. Whose Crypt Lord is that? It is Sheik's Crypt Lord. Sheik is on the right. Okay. Do we have a, another hero here for Happy? No. Happy is probably gonna just gonna buy a Dark Ranger, like normal. There's a Tome of Intelligence here. Does he pick it up? So you cannot get to the tavern until you first creep this creep camp. I don't know if they, uh, if these creeps are awake or asleep during the day. A player's forces are under attack. A player's forces are under attack. Okay, happy going for this creep camp. Does he have web? There's two dragons. Maybe he doesn't care about the little dragons. Oh, he does grab the dragons. This creep camp is pretty strong, by the way. One level nine and four level six creeps. That's uh, pretty strong. The Dark Ranger tanked a bit of damage. The Death Knight gets a demonic figurine. Are you kidding me? This item is so strong. I mean, again, in this matchup, it's still so strong. Like, if your opponent wants to get the destroyers to dispel it, he can do that. But destroyers aren't that great in this matchup. Sometimes you're forced to get one, or two, or three. But it's not really uh, your preference, because the destroyers get killed by the fiends. He TPs out. Okay, he TPs out because just walking home takes too long. He buys another TP. A player's forces are under attack. And he's going this way. I assume he will go this way. Sheik with the Crypt Lord. Isn't that cute? He went Crypt Lord. Sheik is on the left side, Jaco. Wait, what? Sheik. What are you talking about? I know Sheik is on the left side on the map. But he's on the right side if we're talking about the uh, heroes and the uh, overlay. Beautiful fight here. Uh, what is Happy doing? Happy's going for this item. He got uh, Warsong Battle Drums. Warsong Battle Drums is a pretty good item. And Sheik, what is he gonna get here? What is he gonna get? He has a Book of the Dead, by the way. What is this? An Ice Shard? Summons an Ice Revenant. The Ice Revenant lasts 180 seconds. Wow, these Please items are pretty good. Storm of Agility, the summon pick it up, the Crypt Lord picks it up. Double Nova, okay, so the Ice Revenant can cast the uh, Frost Nova. The Fiends are 2 0. These Fiends are 0 0. Wow, Sheik with much better upgrades. Happy went over 50 already, though. Death Knight, what's he gonna buy? What's he gonna sell? Invo Potion, I assume. There it is. Look at these skeletons just scouting. Banshee's here for Sheik. Happy going for an expansion. And does he get Banshee's as well? I assume so. Yeah, there, there are his Banshee's. There are Adapt. Sheik's Banshee's, I assume, are also Adapt. Yeah. There's no expansion on the islands, by the way. On this map. A town is under siege. Okay, well, happy with the TP. He is behind in upgrades, but the uh, up in supply. And he summons the Doom Guard, stomps even. This means the TP is going to be later. There's some the destroyer. And oh, look, he's fighting. I'm not sure if I like this for Sheik. He cannot fight here. I mean, you know, this I have not goes down before it did anything. It only had like uh, it had less uh, hit points than the Doom Guard. Doom Guard with the stomp is beautiful. Uh, someone got silenced there. This is uh, unwinnable fight here for Sheik. Even with the better upgrades, this uh, the fiend gets a coil. There goes another fiend. This destroyer, uh, this uh, Doom Guard in the back. I'm just you know seeing him kill stuff. It's just beautiful. He is uh, 
He has mana for one more spell. There's a GG by Sheik. And there's another Stomp. Just to uh, show you guys how strong that Doomguard really is. 3-0. Easy peasy game. <laughs>